five new secrets in the latest Brookhaven update. This one is the semi-truck update. It is crazy full of secrets, just like every update in Brookhaven. Usually Wolfpack knows the community loves just a little dab of secrets, and he always fills that void. I mean, with every update, we get a secret here, there, and everywhere, and it's so nice, and to the extent that we had a whole update that was about secrets like a month ago, right? It was so much fun. Where is Rosie? Rosie's right here on my shoulder. What do you mean? Guys, be sure to go get the Rosie shoulder pet, the coolest thing ever, and subscribe, and it will post notifications for the moment, making it go ding. If one of you, just one of you, have the heart to subscribe, I will love you forever. But most importantly, guys, let's crush and destroy the likes on this video, guys. If we can get 200 likes within this video being up just within the first five minutes, oh my god, I'm giving away 10 million Robux. Holy moly, that was a bit... I got ahead of myself that I'll give away some Robux. I can't give away 10 million. What is 10 million Robux even equal, dude? Like, <laughs> I feel like that's a lot of money, dude. I, I would I would no longer be able to afford making these videos for you guys. <laughs> but uh, either way, dude, I have to be honest with you guys. I am still adjusting and getting used to seeing the map change here. Because I was so used to the map being, like, just flat alongside here and not getting the estate area like it's super weird i i don't know i, I can't believe wolf i finally did a drastic major change to the actual brookhaven map and the layout of the landscape like i mean i i know the forest area the little summer camp got introduced and the giant trees got introduced and that was a big change but this one is it, it's a really big leap right i mean with the estate game passes and stuff it gets kind of crazy but let's start looking at some of these secrets before i get sidetracked too much Okay, okay, can you understand that, dude? I'm in my I'm in my private server right now, by the way, and nobody even knows I'm in here. I just joined in. <laughs> Secret as ever, dude. No one has a clue. Uh, <laughs> but if you guys would like to join into the private server and play sometime, all you guys got to do is join our Roblox group called ONG Group, or follow me on Roblox. The links are in the description. My username is totally not ONG. Not suspicious at all, right? All right, so let's get into <coughs> the first secret are you guys ready all right so what we're going to want to do for the first one we want to spawn any semi truck it doesn't matter except the party one you don't want the party one and then you want to go to the back here okay go to the back let me show you something in the back i got some stuff in the back so if we go ahead and spawn this in now we're going to actually look at something that's very interesting so let's go ahead and click this button right here on the right right as you open the back of your semi truck you will notice it starts changing the themes and as you keep going the themes get darker and darker till you get to this one this one is super odd, and it actually ties into some of the lore and the craziness regarding Mr. Brookhaven and the agency and the rivalry between the two and the constant war. And it gets spooky, dude. There is coffins. There is small chairs, just like that in the vampire house. And of course, there is a note here showing that the agency is in fact here. And if you click this note after activating a few things, you will notice it will start burning just like the one in the top of the hospital. Just kidding. I mean, that would be cool, though. Uh, I actually have been trying to activate different secrets and see if there's any way to get this note to activate, but it's really tricky because look guys, it looks like I can click on it, right? Wrong. That's just the actual vehicle name, right? So people have been people have been sending me stuff like, look, I can click on the note, dude. I'm like, dude, that is the that is the vehicle where you can name the vehicle. So yeah, I, I know it looks like it's clickable, guys, but it's actually not at this current moment. So I did want to clarify that and clear that up. So that's the first secret, dude. Thank you for clapping. I really appreciate it. I, I often worry if I'm, I'm doing good here. All right, so now let's actually get into the next one, which is regarding one of the new estate homes. Yeah, you gotta love it, guys. These new estates are no joke. So let's go ahead and spawn in the uh, southern estate. That will do just fine. And let's get the prison. So the prison is full of all kinds of secret rooms and secret items and things you can find in the secret rooms and everything. It's very intricate and crazy. And I have yet to even find all the secrets in this prison because it's so huge. So one of the things I do want to show you guys is how to escape the prison right away. Okay, so say you get locked up, dude. You, 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 you stole some beans okay why would you steal a can of beans of all things dude but you did and now you're locked up in a horrible horrible series of events so what you guys can do is in some of the cells you can actually find a secret way to escape now in some of the cells just like this first one that i entered you will see that you can actually go through the wall and there is a ladder a ladder that takes you up to the second floor if that be the case but there is underground tunnels everywhere underneath this prison. So, if we go on down, we're gonna need a flashlight, man. I can't see nothing down here. So, if we get our little trusty flashlight, we will see that we are completely underground now. Now, 
Once you find this underground series of tunnels, you will be you will be really surprised to know that if you follow the right path, you will be able to escape fully. I'm not kidding. Look at this. So you can go here and walk right out and escape the prison. How cool is that, dude? And then you're you're free. You're free to be in whoever you want to be, dude. It's pretty cool. But that's not everything about the prison. Moving on to the third new secret that we're going to be looking at on this list. It's also to do with the prison. Because I figured, you know, we gotta add some prison stuff in there, dude. Prison is my favorite addition in this new update. Although, the semi-trucks have been winning lately. I've been really enjoying those things. Um, let's go look at the next one. So, people have been asking me, even though I did a video on this, well, I don't know where the prison safe is. I, I just don't know that. And I'm like, Sir, what do you mean you don't know? Alright, so, anyways. The prison safe is actually kind of confusing, I guess, guys, because there's a lot of rooms in the prison that you just don't, you don't even pay no attention to, like this one or the showers, like, it, it's a big place, I understand that. So, um, right away, guys, if you want to find the safe, all you got to do is walk through the first entrance, come over here, or not here, just go back here in this room, where the little entryway is, where you meet people, and go in this room here, it's like a little break room, and this is where the safe is going to be in the prison estate, so... Pretty cool, right? So that's where your safe's gonna be, and you can also access it right here in the employees only entryway. That's pretty cool, right? So there is your prison safe location. Went over that again. We're gonna add that to the third one on this list, but let's go to the fourth one, which is also to do with the prison. So let's go ahead and head through here in the visitor entryway. I have clearance, guys, don't worry. Like I said, if you guys see the previous videos, I work at this prison, okay? I just don't have my outfit on right now. It's just. I couldn't be bothered, okay? Um, I, I still, I, I, even though I'm a sheriff, I like to wear my Rosie merch, okay? Don't judge me. Rosie is the most beautiful cat around. She is so gorgeous. So, let's go ahead and walk through here and head to the back of the cafe. Or the kitchen. It's not a cafe, dude. <laughs> but right here is the new item that get introduced, which is the prison food. And you might not know this exists, but yeah, there's a new item now, and it also is available in your backpack. So, say you don't want to go to prison to get some prison food, you can just spot it right here from your backpack. Pretty cool, right? I think so. Thank you. You know, I wonder why, well, the school cafeteria don't have, like, a little tray. It just has, like, some pizza and stuff, which is actually really funny. So, now, let's get to the final secret that I want to show you guys in this five new secret video of the semi-truck update, and that is also to do with the prison, and that is, of course, the color-changing things. And how many of these things can you use, right? First off, guys, you cannot use the garage button. It doesn't do anything with the prison house, I know. And you cannot use premium features. So premium features would normally be like a house pool or something, but you can't really use that, right? So um, you cannot do that. Hey, <laughs> oh, what you did? Someone called me. He's here, check the server. Yo, I <laughs> did someone call me that. You called me, hold on, let me say. You called me. You called me. Yo, nah. <laughs> He's like, nah, dude. This a yo. No way, it's really. Why is everybody saying yo? <laughs> I'm a big fan. You know, uh, Jasper, I'm a big fan of you for being a big fan. So thank you so much. Um, but yeah, um, you can you cannot use all the these features here guys but you can change the color of things so you can change the color of like the railways if you want to go full black that looks pretty cool don't it so do realize that guys you can change the color of your prison uh here i've seen so many people not know this like that's why i wanted to include it as a feature that you can change because so many people don't know you can change this it also changes the color of little things throughout. See, like now these chairs are black, right? You can make agent agency chairs, basically. So you can change everything black and make it agency. Now, the one thing I am sad is it doesn't. Your house sign doesn't do nothing as well. I know, dude. It, it, it's uh, I've been in uh, the server for hours. Real OG does not talk. He's fake. <laughs> dude, why am I not allowed to talk if I see you guys? Like. Everybody accuses me of being fake, dude. Stop it, guys, okay? Um, I, the thing is, guys, with a private server, a lot of you little tricksters out there pretend to be me. So when I do finally turn in, uh, like, go into the server, people are like, nah, you're that one guy uh, pretending to be OG. And then, <laughs> and then it ends up really being me, right? So it, it's a problem. Okay, fine. He's real. 
Uh, but anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Five new secrets in the Brook Kevin Semi Truck update. Shout out to all the fans here in the server right now. Love you guys so much. You guys are legends. And uh, dude, we got a cool community here. We're continuing to grow on a daily basis. Wolfpack continues to drop amazing updates. And I hope to see this just keep going as long as it can, right? This is great. Brookhaven RP still to this day is my favorite game on Roblox. And I just love it so, so much. Like, dude, this is like my most favorite game ever, dude. Uh, but yeah. Also, can't forget, hello, Rosie. Rosie said hi. <laughs> Rosie said hi. Anyway, see you guys in the next one.